Hello everyone and welcome back to Human Resource Machine. Now last episode we did the Fibonacci Visitor after about three years of working at it. And I've decided that at least for now I am going to stay away from these left-sided ones because they're not required as you can see. And they're so much harder. <laughs> it is that simple. They are just way, 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 way harder. So maybe I'll go back to them after I've like reached the end program. Maybe, but for now... We're just gonna continue. We're just gonna go up the right. So zero terminated sun. What are we gonna do for this one? <laughs> yes, we believe in educating our place on a job. No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Tell me more. Exactly. Okay. Like one, two, three, four, five. Okay, or four, nine, two, nine, two. And so another string begins. Okay, zero. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's kind of weird, but I, I guess that makes sense. I guess that makes sense. Um, so, the inbox is filled with zero terminated strings. What's that? Ask me, your boss. Add together all the numbers in each string. When you reach the end of a string, mark by zero, put the sum in your outbox. Reset and repeat for each string. That seems really easy. So, inbox, copy to zero. Uh, no, it doesn't say anything about using a zero to mark like, anything in the outbox here. Pretty sure you can see my mouse. Um, inbox copy to zero. Then... If zero... We're gonna have a lot of it. Jump, jump if zeros. Uh, if zero... Copy from zero an outbox. And then I'll be a... No bump, a jump. Different letter to start, please. And if not, it's just going to be uh, inbox add to zero. Then copy from zero. And I guess we put a jump there. Is that it? Just takes it from zero, copies it to zero. Uh, and if that if that is zero, then it just outbox a zero. Um, uh, if zero, then cop from zero and outbox. No. Yes, no. Pineapple. What? Let's try that. I think that'll work. Okay, yep. Ah, uh, whoops, nope, nope, that was wrong. I saw what happened there. Need to add, then copy to zero. Guess we don't need that copy from then. Let's try that. Okay, yeah. Get 13, I copy it too. It's not a zero, so yeah, keep going. Ah. We need that there. Okay, yeah. Good. Oh, that's a zero, so... Yay! Speed this up a bit. Watch a little worker zoom through this. Yay, see what I mean? This... I think we may already have it, in which case... This just illustrates exactly what I was saying. These ones are so much easier. Whoops. Okay. I was wrong, and I don't even know I went wrong because I pressed the wrong button. By the way, we seem to have pretty much got it. In which case, these ones are so much easier than the other ones. The left side. Okay. Up in there. Why did they expect a zero? 
О. I don't know what went wrong there. I'll check the math myself on this. So we got 5, minus 7 is minus 2, add 4 is 2, uh, 3, 2, 5. Why are you expecting a 0? I don't know. I really have no idea why they're expecting a 0. Oh, yes I do. Aha. Because that was just a single one and that just skipped it. So we need a... Yeah, a jump if zero here. So like down here I guess. Um, that just copies from five out boxes, then jumps back to the start. Let's try that. Speed up a bit. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Yep, so this is, should be the point where we get... Yep. Yep. Perfect, so let's speed this up then. And... Lovely. You see what I mean? Six and a half minutes this one took us. Fibonacci sequence took me about 40 minutes. How much easier are these? Yeah. So let's see. To reduce that carbon footprint, now I'm going to try and read that. Okay. <laughs> okay. For each zero terminated string in the inbox, send the smallest. Send to the outbox only the smallest number you've seen in that string. You'll never be given an empty string. Reset to repeat for each string. We could negative them. Or sub them. And if it's a negative... Okay, I'll be stuck with an inbox. I'm gonna copy that, it's zero. Uh, we're gonna inbox... Copy one. How, how long is the longest string going to be? I'm guessing five, because that seems what what they like. Uh, we'll sub from zero. And if negative... If it's negative, then that'll mean that number is bigger. So I want to ignore that number and want to keep zero. Yeah. So if it's negative... Go back to there. If it's not, then we're going. We're going to want to inbox, copy to zero, then sub one. Uh, and then if negative, jump there. And if not, then we're going to want to. And if it's not negative, then what we're going to want to do is... Uh... Yeah? If not, we're going to want to go back to here, I think. Let's try that. Just occurred to me. We're going to need to get... <laughs> that, put in, that's put, that allows for no way for there to be an, an ending. How do we account for an ending? Oh, it's terminated by zero. Duh. So we're gonna wanna jump if zero there. Which you know, we want it at the inbox. And then jump if zero at the inbox. To <coughs> uh I suppose if it's from there, then it's gonna have been zero. That's the biggest number. So if it's, it's from this, no, yeah, it's from that one, then we're going to want them to copy from zero and out box, and then jump back to the beginning. <laughs> My apologies. Uh, and if not, then we're going to want them to copy from one 
a box, then jump back to the beginning. Oh, not the beginning. Let's give that a shot. Speed up a bit. Okay, so is this going to be the right way around? No, it's not. It was, it's, that was the wrong way around. <laughs> so, we're going to want this to... No. <coughs> I need to inverse what I've been doing. So... Copy from zero. Sub one. Copy from one. Sub zero. One. Zero. Let's try that. Okay, so it's gonna get, and that's negative. So, num for so one must be sh smaller. <laughs> then if a zero. Oh no, got those the wrong way around. Shouldn't have swapped those. Okay, let's try that. So, okay, yep, you take that, then you get that, you sub that, and you should get negative four. So you know that six is smaller. So you replace the ten with the two, and you take them. So you know the six. Is, uh, so you know the two is smaller. Yeah. That worked. Let's try speeding up a bit. Okay. Perfect. Are you going to get the 8 from the string? Yep. Yeah, everything seems to be going well. Lovely! Haha! <laughs> I'm not even going to bother with the challenges. They're insane. What was the purpose of this assignment? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> First in the inbox, outbox is sum of itself plus all numbers down to zero. For example, if the inbox is three, outbox should be six, because three plus two plus one is six. Okay, that sounds horrible. Well, XTL only goes up to four, so we can probably account for that. Let's try just doing that. Can we get nicer numbers? Oh, no. Can I have my old numbers back? I'll take that. <laughs> so, inbox. Copy to, copy to zero. Uh, copy to zero. Gonna say copy to one and negatively bump one. And copy from one. I'll put a jump of zero to down there. Else just jump back there. Oh no. Yes, no, no. No. No 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 we can't do that. So we need to get it so that it's just Continues going down until it's done. So just for jump if zeros repeatedly. Uh, so we want to copy from one. Yeah. So then copy to two. Negatively bump to copy from two. And again jump of zero. Um, I'm gonna have to put multiple of these in because we need to get all the way up to four. So we're gonna have one, two, three. Anyways, 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1. So yeah, 4 numbers, so we need it up to 3. So... B1, 2... Yeah, 3 jump to 0. So we'll just do that again then. It's going to be a really cheesy way to do it, but that's fine. Yeah, as long as it works. So, copy to 3. Negatively bump 3. Copy from 3. Okay, so... And then jump of zero. That should be zero uh, otherwise. Yeah, it's had three bumps so it needs actually needs one more. Doesn't it? It's had three negative Yeah, actually needs to go one more time. Good thing I noticed that. So copy to four. It should be four, three, two, one. I suppose it has to have a zero. So I can jump if zero. Okay, that's fine. Um Copy to four, negatively bump four, 
copy from four. Jump at zero. Okay. And then once it's at zero, we want to. Uh, da -da -da -da. Okay, we're gonna do. So for that one, I'll only have spaces in one. So we're going to want to copy from. Yeah, want that there. Copy from five. This will have been if well if it's become to one. So we need this to copy to two oops three and four. This one we need it to copy from five. Then copy to two three and four. This one we need to copy from five, then copy to three and four. Actually, we don't need to copy them. To, uh, yeah, it couldn't do harm. And I'll just skip out the last one because that isn't needed. And this is like the biggest thing I've ever done. It's mad. Like, this is stupidly big. It's pointlessly big. I know you can get this small. I know that for a fact. It wouldn't be this big. And, yeah, I'm not even gonna... not even gonna look at the challenges. <laughs> Oops, that's supposed to be there. Uh, so then after this done, there's jumps up here. That looks nicer. No, it doesn't. Well, screw you, then. Um... After jumping the jumps up here, we want to t we want to go from zero, add to one, add to two, add to three, add to four, outbox, then jump all the way back to the top of the stupidly long code that doesn't need to be this long, but hopefully this works. Otherwise, I'm going to cry. Okay, there's the zero twice, that's fine. And then it should, it should just be adding zero, which should do nothing to it. Great! Okay, yep. Copies it. Uh, uh, it doesn't matter. It didn't occur to me that we wouldn't actually need that to happen again. Yeah, it's fine. Seems to work. What happens when it gets a zero? Oh, I don't think I counted for that. No, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. So, we're going to want to put to just a jump of zero to there. Mommy. No, actually, a jump of zero to there. And we're going to have to put another step in here, actually. I'm going to put one there. And, well, they'll already have a zero, so we just put that. Copy to one. Copy to two. Copy to three. Copy to four. And then jump all the way to there. And now we're going to just play and restart until we get nicer numbers. Because mine can only really cope with up to four. Up to four, not five. This is such a cheesy way to do it. Four. Four. I'm not going to get a four again, am I? Please. Shall I just code it to a. I can't do it. Five, four, three, two, one. No, it doesn't work. No, I. This this system only works if it's up to four. If it's any higher than four, it doesn't work. No. No. 
I know this is such a stupidly cheesy way to do it, but it's the only way I can figure out to do it. Come on. Come on. No. 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 <sighs> Stop making my life so hard. Please. Please, game, please. Please. I'll be back with some nicer numbers. And we're back with our really cheesy method. I actually had to, like, X out the level after cutting my entire code, I had to copy and paste it. Um, <laughs> then exit the level, come back in like four times, and finally I got a 4304, which should work. If this doesn't, I'm going to cry. Well, I'm not, but still. Please work. Please. Please. Please work. Please work, game. Please. Okay, good, 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 good. You gonna work for the three as well? Okay, good. Yeah. Should be a one. If I turn this to a zero, as you know that will. Lovely. I just replace those zeros with zeros. That's fine. Doesn't matter. We're not gonna get the steps or stuff challenges with this anyway. <laughs> There's just no way. Come to zero. Aha! Yeah, yeah, you can add them all you want. Now, please work. Yep, yep, yep. Get it there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, I'm foiled. Oh, I'm foiled. Got me. They found out my plan. <sighs> Can't cheese it like that. It's disappointing. Uh, how could oh, oh my god, duh. How stupid am I? Copy to zero. Copy to one. Uh, negatively bump one. Every bump one. And copy from one. That's a zero. Then if we... we hit that, we just copy it to zero. And then... We've got that, and then we just need to go back to one. Yeah, there's that number. Then we can put, like, a jump here. And jump if zero. If it's if it's zero, I'll free you. You're gonna want to copy from zero. A box and jump. Let's try that. My plan was foiled. Oh yeah, that was a that was actually super easy. He says noticing the giant problem there. In box. Jump of zero. Oh, box. Oh my god, that was actually so easy. But I decided to try and take a really cheesy method. And I got punished for it. The game punished me. The game just wasn't taking any of my shit, was it? <laughs> uh, point C, human resource machine. You... You not only have my love of a good game, but you have my respect of not putting up with gamer shit. Uh, that's great. Okay, well let's... <laughs> uh, I love that. I, I just love that. So, props to them, seriously. Oh, what's going on here? Okay. This is depressing.
What the f Where am I working? What? <laughs> I have no idea what I just saw. Getting close to the end now. I reckon one or two more episodes and we should be done. Let's have a look at storage flush, see how easy it is. This. Maybe, maybe we'll do it this episode, maybe not. Big chance is coming! Okay. Imagine each thing in the inbox is an address, and each address refers to a tile 0 to 9 on the floor. Your task for each address in the inbox, pick up the letter of that address and outbox it. Congratulations, you can access tiles on the floor indirectly! What? How did... Oh! So... Ah, I like that. Okay, that's actually really easy. Yeah, we can do that right now. Inbox. No, no, no. no. It's a copy. Two. Ten. And then copy from the weird ten. And outbox. And jump. Try that. Yeah, that's actually really easy. He's gonna spell a word. A E. A. -E. Nah, it's not. Still, that's actually quite cool. I like that. Glad we did it. Hey, I did a challenge! Ah, I did the challenge! I did the challenge, yes! Sorry! String storage floor. Right, again, let's check it out. Oh god. For, th for each thing in the inbox is addressed on the tile on the floor. For each address provided in the inbox, outbox the requested item from the floor and all the following items on the floor until you reach a zero. Repeat. Get. Th. Tar. Awake. Is. XXX. You what? <laughs> I. <laughs> Words. So... <laughs> um... Well, inbox, copy to 24, copy from 24, outbox, <coughs> then... Negatively bump. 24. A legit copy from 24. And then jump of 0. No. No, 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 no. I'm gonna copy from that 24. And then if that's 0, <coughs> then. We want to start again. If it's not, then we want to do that. Oh, no, 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 no. That. Let's try that. Okay, so we got four. Just take the T. A book sack. And that's a zero. Okay, 
Good, 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 good. Speed us up a bit. Oh, no. Up in there. You're supposed to take H. Well, how are we supposed to take H? H is... How are you expecting a H? Oh, it's upwards. Oh. Sorry, I thought it was... I thought it was backwards, not forwards. Oh, whoops. So... This needs to be a... Is it there? A positive bump to 24. Whoops. Let's try that. So the four, so we get it. We should get a T, then we should get the H. Yeah, and this is going to be the last one. There we go. And then we get the zero. So, we start again. Okay, so now we can speed this up a bit. The... The TA... The TAR... The TARGET... Oh, I already know I'm gonna love this message. The target. X, X, X. That'll be the, t the target's code name. Is awake. Oh, is. Yeah, awake. <laughs> X, X. T. Take Take this X X <laughs> uh, The target is awake X X X that'll be the target name. Or does yeah. I lo I like that message. I can't even remember it already, but I like it. Hundred and seventy seven steps, we are way under the challenge. Nice. But yeah, I am going to end it here, so if you did enjoy the episode, please smash the like button. If you didn't, please leave a dislike, but if you wouldn't mind, leave in the comments why did you enjoy the episode. If you want to see more from me, go ahead and smash uh, be that subscribe button, sorry. If you feel like you want to, go ahead and follow me on Twitter, the link should be in the description, hopefully. And yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye!